years. Teams had, for lack of a better term, concentration issues when they faced some shorthanded squads. I mean, the Lakers obviously with LeBron, Sacramento we know obviously what happened with Philly. What, I guess, was your message to them today that they need to start taking Tim seriously no matter who was missing? Yeah, it really was a standard that we have to have for each other. Uh, and that part of it is, you know, we talked a little bit about it is finishing plays. You didn't see as many breakdowns at the end of plays tonight, uh, the concentration level. So a big piece of that is just holding each other ball in a higher standard. And uh, uh, I thought from the beginning of the game, you saw that a lot more talk from each other, a lot more com communication, a lot more demand of each other, which was great to see also. For me, seeing him um, when we first drafted him to now, I think the, the ability to play on a nightly basis, uh, to get your mind and your body ready to, right now he's starting for us. And so uh, the matchups are different. Uh, tonight you have a, a longer athletic guy that you're guarding. Uh, a few nights ago you might have been guarding a, a bigger guy that is 40 pounds stronger than you. Uh, and so how do you mentally and physically prepare yourself on a nightly basis? We see him get better at it. Talk about the, uh, the demanding of their teammates. I mean, was Kevin an example of that? I mean, it looked like he was explaining to Joe how he wanted something done defensively. Yeah, which was, was great. Force. You know, Brian, it really was, you know, our film session this morning was very open and let's talk about some of these uh, scenarios that are happening. And uh, because we want that to continue onto the court. And so really trying to get this group to open up, demand of each other, uh, talk out there on the floor. Uh, it's a huge part of us being better defensively. Uh, when the team hold each other accountable, that, that's all. You, that's what you want. And uh, what way is going to be confidence boosting and encouraging that Kevin can only take ten shots for twelve points and he can still get a win? And, and he feels totally, you know, great about it uh, after the game, which was great to see him in the locker room, excited that uh, you know multiple people in double digits. Uh, he always says that's that's team basketball right there. Now that, that was a prime example tonight. Coach, uh, yeah, do you think that uh, uh, right now, especially with this these last games uh, for, uh, from Ben Simmons, uh, Simmons, Irving, and Durant are are reaching uh, together the the the, 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 level, the expected level from from three to there. We hope so. You know, it's still early for this group. They really haven't played together. And, uh, you know, Ben, as you see, is just feeling better physically, which is helping us, um, you know, for him to go coast to coast and get easy baskets for us, to push the pace for us, to get open shots for everybody else. And they're learning how to play with him and play with his pace. So um, hopefully we're growing. Those combinations going to change as we get healthier, and uh, they'll continue to play better with each other. I don't know, do you think um, a lot of times uh, Simmons has been criticized for, uh, for, his, for his lack of shooting? In, in, the, in his case, with, uh, in, the, in that case, with uh, Irving and Durant, do you think that is even better for you that Ben Simmons uh, doesn't take a lot of shots? I think it's a luxury. Uh... Most people in basketball want to score the basketball all the time and thinking about scoring. You know, you got a guy that is not thinking about scoring but making his teammates better majority of the time that he's on the floor. Uh, that's a, a luxury. He really enjoys getting other people involved. And uh, when we can surround shooting with him, uh, pretty, pretty tough to, to guard. Doc, what's clicked for him since L.A.? Nick, I think it's really the, the body piece you know, really come into the game. And, uh, you know, I think he was at maybe 14, 15 minutes at halftime, and he was telling me to put him back in, you know, the last three minutes of the half. And I said, just hold off. Uh, but he said, I, felt, I feel good. Uh, and then when he's telling me he feels good, I, I think he's, he's 